the key on the short squeeze of AMC, the key to going to the moon, the key to getting to the price for AMC that you, you, you've you never imagined in your wildest dream, the key of all of these things we are all in together, it's staying strong in holding. I hold for you, you hold for me. We buy on the dips, we continue to hold. That's the key. That's the only key that will get us to where we want to be and we will not have to worry about money anymore. Well, for those who will be smart in the way they manage their money, well, we're going to talk about it in a different video. But if you want to know, please drop a comment below. Well, guys, I want to talk about something that other people might be concerned with, paper hands, okay? I see on the comment on my videos, I see on social media, I see on the internet that paper hands, you know, it doesn't matter if you count in the 20%, I mean the 20-80 uh, uh, rule or the 80-20 rule for that matter, <laughs> it doesn't really matter because I think the short squeeze and the situation with AMC is getting, is going even way beyond getting rich or getting money, all right? Because um, I know if you don't have, if you never hold $10,000 in your hand, if you never seen or owned 10,000 in your account, well, when you do hit that mark, you will start freaking out. Yeah, I know, because the first time my account, you know, reached 100,000, I freaked out. And the last, I mean, the first thing, I mean, the first time it got to 200,000, I did freak out because never before in my life, I've, I've, I've been sitting on so much cash. I've been sitting on so much money, okay? But I didn't sold. I mean, I'm not talking about AMC. I'm talking about other stocks that I bought before AMC. <laughs> so that to say, guys, that even though we know paper hands will always be paper hands, I think throughout the dips, throughout the attacks from the shorts, throughout being constantly bashed and trashed on the media and being, you know, trashed by our relatives and friends telling us that this is a dead cat, um, we've, we, we've toughened, we've toughened up, we've, we've leveled up, we've manned up to the occasion. And that's why it's not even about money anymore. It's really about our why. Why are we doing this? For some of us, it's really about, I mean, I guess it's all of us. For all of us, it's really about making things straight. Wall Street and the big pockets and the suits so far have got their ways into doing whatever. And by whatever, I mean whatever they want in the stock market and get whatever they want out of it. But the, sh the, the retailers, the apes, in 2021 are now saying no, they're saying stop. Now we want to regain the power that we have and we want the things to be even now. We want things to be flat. We want the market to be and act like a freaking market. So with AMC, GameStop and any other stock that you guys shorted for no specific reason other than you making bazillions billions of money well it's now time for you to get screwed for others the why is really not even about money i mean by money i mean treating themselves okay i mean i know i mean there was a uh, probably a youngster who wanted to get a true arc uh, uh, with his gains, I know a lot of us might, might, might be willing to, you know, ride on in Ferraris and Lambos and everything. But I think a lot of us also want to help family, you know, uh, uh, um, get treatment for cancer, for example, to friends, to kids, to grandkids, to relatives, or maybe completely change your life, completely 360% change the course of your life and more importantly the life of your kids because you want a better market for them you want a better life for them you want a better world for them and that's why i think there will be less paper hands as we move up even though even though the more we move up the more difficult it will be to continue to hold because we will get to that sum of money that we've never owned before in the past but i guess together will hold each other accountable because without each other, there is no squeeze. And without and with no squeeze, there is no life being changed. So 
just my two cents guys